Doing a dental check on an American alligator is no simple task. So we've got the entire team out here this afternoon. Soon our alligators will go into brumation for the winter. Before that happens, we're gonna do a bit of a health check on our population of American alligators here at the Australian Reptile Park. Now this alligator here would perhaps be 70 or 80 years of age. So we're just checking the teeth. You can see these teeth are a little yellow, but not unusual for an alligator, um, particularly one of this boy's age. Next up is one of our females. Now she's a lot smaller than a male, but she's a lot quicker and a lot more feisty. Kissing away. So on top of checking the large males, we're also making sure to check on some of these smaller females. This was actually a female that laid a clutch of eggs back in January, and she's put on nice weight, but going into winter, we wanna make sure that she's in good nick. So this next male, he's not the largest male in the lagoon, but he's certainly known for throwing his weight around a bit. He's been really stubborn and he's really heavy. Doug is back feeding, he's not moving, so I'm gonna to have to get in there behind him and uh, give him a little push up the bank. Overall, this health check was really positive. Everyone looks in really great condition heading into winter. Now we don't feed our American alligators over winter. The water temperature drops too low for them to digest food. So we'll start feeding the alligators again once it warms up in September or October. All right, three. 